Hello and welcome to HeartNets. I'm Reverend Carol. I'm going to share this Bible verse from Matthew chapter 11, verse 24. Therefore I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours. Now I used to struggle with that particular Bible verse. God knows there were many times I asked and didn't receive. But over the years, I've come to a new understanding of it, both at a deeper spiritual level and also on a personal human level. You know, on a spiritual level, it's about faith. You know, faith that what I've asked for has already been given. Not on a material level, but what the true desire is. Perhaps it's comfort or healing or harmony or simply to be more of a presence of love in this world. I've also come to understand that I always receive. I just must be open to see it and not how I specifically pictured it but how Spirit has provided it to me in a way that is for my highest self and the higher self of others. Now on a human level, part of my understanding is that I must ask for help, you know, from my family, my friends, from you, my spiritual community. We, or I, <laughs> can get in trouble when we believe we must do it ourselves and for whatever reason we do not reach out and ask and I have been reminded lately to do just that and not to take on so much on my own so to my spiritual community I am asking for your help there is much to be done, and we are a community of gifted, talented spiritual beings. So in the next few weeks, I'll be asking you to give of your time and talents and revitalizing our buildings and our grounds, and cleaning, painting, landscaping, and to train and to participate and prepare our youth and family ministry for the new school year, for a new beginning, and for so much more. You know, we are a spiritual community that is grounded in prayer, asking or claiming, believing, having faith, and receiving. For God is always up to something good at Unity Church Austin. Love, light, and sparkles.